Hey guys, Nick here from Nightlife Kennel. We're gonna start a brand new series called Coon Hunting Quick Tips. Many times a week I get you guys messing me, asking me questions about how I do this and that and the other. And I thought it'd be a lot easier if we just start putting out a new video, say every week or every two weeks, discussing some of these frequently asked questions. That way you guys will have something to reference back to. We're gonna start out this week with a commonly asked question. It's probably the most commonly asked question I get is how do you train your dogs? Um, to be honest with you guys, this can be broke down into a very, very lengthy video. But we're gonna try to make this short. I'll give you the bullet points of it basically. Um, basically, if you're gonna start with a brand new pup, eight weeks old, you pick up the pup till they're about six months old. The only thing we do with that dog is teach them basic kennel manners. We get them used to us. We bond with the dog. We might work them on, um, you know, I like to, my dogs to go in the house when I feed them so they're not coming out and knocking food bowl out of my hands. I take them for walks. And then of course, lead training too. You get the dogs used to lead. And I might even put them in a box and take them for a ride to town back and forth a few times just to get them used to a box because a lot of times they tend to get car sick over stuff like that. Now from about six months old to a year, what we do is we start taking them in the woods with an experienced dog like Hyde here. And what this does is we let the older dog basically take the pup off at their own pace when they're ready and start showing them how to hunt. A lot of times when you do this though, your dog is going to hang out near your feet. It's not going to necessarily go hunting. We don't push the dog too much when they're really young like this. And they just let them go on their own pace. Now, if they get around a year old and they're hanging around your feet, you're going to have to make them go on. But uh, from that six month old to a year old, we let them do their own pace. And generally, you know, it can vary between dog to dog. But you get around eight, ten months old, that dog will generally start being going off with the experienced dog and maybe even up and on track and even treating this on coon, which is awesome. Um, basically, once the dog actually starts going off, striking the track and train with another dog we go ahead and start soloing them out what that is is we don't hunt with the experienced dog anymore we just take them out completely by themselves and we start working them on uh, their independence where they don't have to meet to or depend on another dog to work a track or figure the tree out for them and then from that time period it could be when they're a year old it could be when they're a year and a half or two years when they start this and generally you just work through this whole process they learn how to track and tree on their own then they generally pick up some kind of off game whether it's tree and possums or run deer or whatever so whatever you get thrown as far as those obstacles are concerned that's when we start breaking the dog on them and generally you get three to four years old um, you've got a dog that you've gone through all the different scenarios of training you've corrected everything you can hopefully everything's worked out great and you have a finished dog so that's kind of the time frame we work for and you gotta remember guys every single dog is different every single dog scenario is different you just kind of have to roll with the punches the main thing is be patient don't expect a one-year-old dog to be finished out and to be doing everything that somebody's four-year-old dog is doing. If you do that and you hang with it and be patient, put in the hard work, it will come around and work out for you guys. So we appreciate it. This is a nightlife coon hunting quick tip.